Hello, it's uh, Pastor Ken from Northminster Presbyterian Church in Tucson, Arizona. I hope that you are having a wonderful day. Uh, we're in the season of Advent, uh, and uh, the scripture that I chose today comes from our Presbyterian uh, mission calendar. Uh, and there's a link below that you can click on if you'd like to read some of the other scriptures for today. Uh, the scripture I wanted to focus on a little bit was uh, comes from Matthew 21. It starts at verse 33 to 46. It's a parable that Jesus tells. And uh, it's a parable that is quite shocking. It's a parable about judgment. It's a parable that has violence associated to it and even murder. It's a parable about a uh, owner of a vineyard who uh, sends some of, his, some of his servants uh, to check on the vineyard because the owner has um, uh, left the care of the vineyard to people that uh, he has trusted. And uh, as his servants go one at a time, uh, the, um, the so-called uh, trusted um, uh, servants who are taking care of uh, the vineyard decide that uh, if they uh, beat or kill the servants, uh, they can take over the vineyard. Uh, they realize uh, that they cannot do that. Uh, and yet the owner, uh, God in this case, uh, keeps sending some servants and the same result happens. Finally, uh, to the surprise of everyone that's listening, the owner, God, sends his own son thinking this will change the way uh, that uh, the people, uh, people act, but it doesn't. In fact, uh, they kill his son, and now for sure they're thinking they will be the owners of the vineyard. Uh, it's, it's a shocking story, and it's a shocking story um, which we may wonder, how does this uh, apply to Christmas, uh, to Advent, uh, the coming of a baby boy born in a manger? But we are reminded in the Gospel of John that the light comes into the world, but the light is not welcome, and the darkness uh, tries to overcome it. It doesn't. It doesn't. But there is still darkness that exists. And so as we think about this Advent uh, season, we also need to uh, come to the realization uh, and uh, live with the fact that not everyone welcomed the coming of the sun into the vineyard. There were those who thought that he didn't belong. There were those that thought that they could seize power by violence, but that has never worked. And it is not the way of the cross. It is not the way of the church. And so during this Advent season, yes, we celebrate uh, beautiful Christmas hymns and praise songs. We celebrate the birth of Jesus, but we are also reminded that in the coming of Jesus, uh, the world is now divided into those, into two, those who accept him and those that reject him. I pray that you have accepted him. And as a church, we continue to, through the transforming grace of the Holy Spirit in our lives, uh, speak and talk about the coming of the Savior who loves us and who died for us. I hope you have a great day. Uh, be safe and be well.